There's a lot of issues going on in this school. From patrol car stage outside Justin Kimball High School to Dallas ISD police in position around the campus. This increased police presence on Monday comes after a series of social media threats of gun violence targeting certain students at this school. We are concerned as parents. The police presence also comes after video was shared on social media of one of the school's hall monitors punching a 17 year old student on Friday. The accused staffer was arrested and he's now out of jail on bond. Bobby Higgs and other parents told me they saw the video of that alleged assault and called it disturbing. I think that the leadership needs to pay more attention to the people who are being hired to, to work with our kids. Dallas ISD police and central office staff also showed a presence at Kimball after hearing students were planning to stage walkouts at noon on Monday. A Dallas ISD staffer says the school provided space in the building for students to gather and voice their concerns. We understand that some of the kids are bad and they get out of hand and I'm not going to deny that at all. I've spent time in the classroom. I do understand that. But as an adult, we have to be smarter. In a lengthy phone conversation with the accused hall monitor, he explained the circumstances that he says led up to hitting the students. But the man said he didn't want to go on record yet with too many details. The worker said the edited video clip that's circulating across social media doesn't tell the entire story. He said, this is really something I didn't want to happen. It's painting a bad image of myself and the school I graduated from. He said, working at my alma mater has been a blessing and I'm not the guy that's being painted on social media. For now, the accused hall monitor is getting attorneys involved. And according to sources, police are working to retrieve video from inside the school back here to get better context into what really happened on Friday. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.